name is Cesar Plasencia. I'm the head coach of Summers River College women's soccer team. Oh, hi, I'm Corey Martin. I've been at CRC for two years. Hi, my name is Alton Krebs and I'm a center defender. I'm Brianna and I'm a center mid. Hi, my name is Anna and I'm the goalkeeper. I'm Kate Burkhart and I play attacking mid. Um, I'm Nicole Sanchez and I play all over the place. <laughs> Kelsey Jansen and I play left forward. This is my 11th year working at CRC as a professor and coach. I coached at Sacramento State University. I was an assistant coach there for uh, five years. <clears throat> I played uh, soccer since I was a, a young young kid. Played professionally for six years uh, and have been coaching youth soccer for about 30. I started playing soccer because my dad played soccer, my sister played soccer, and my brother played soccer. I started playing soccer because it's been a family sport my entire life. My whole family's played it and my dad started me on it. My dad was a very enthusiastic soccer player. My dad put me in soccer when I was like four or five years old, and it's been a family sport, so we all play it. My, my brother and my sister play it. I got into soccer because I used to watch my sister play when I was little. I just started playing at the age of four and continued on. My mom forced me. Uh, we, we are, I think, in our seventh straight season at Cosumnes River College of being in the playoffs. We've gone to the state final once. We uh, typically go into deep, deep into the playoffs um, and uh, uh, pretty successful in terms of uh, being one of the elite programs in the state. You know, we have a, a very difficult schedule. It's one of the biggest challenges we have is our schedule. We play, uh, we've played so far the number one team in the nation, the number four team in the nation, the number seven team in the nation. Uh, so we play a real difficult schedule. We play in the Big A conference, which is very, very difficult. Uh, uh, many consider it the most difficult conference in the state. We're pretty solid. I mean, there's a lot of team chemistry. A lot of us have been playing together for years. years. Now, so. I think our team's really good. We got a new, like a few new players, so that's really helped us out. I think the first couple of games. We've needed to like figure out each other, how each other plays. I think it's getting better from there. I think this team, we're going to do really good this season. we got a strong team. We're still working out some kinks, but this season's going to go really well. We just have a small team. That's the only thing that's not good. But other than that, we're solid. I think this team is really, really talented. We have a lot of good players, and I think this season we're going to go far. I think that we are one of the strongest teams, and that we're going to make the playoffs and Win, win it all. You know, we, we'd like to win a Big A conference. We haven't done that. We've, we've been in contention, but we haven't won one. We'd, we'd like to do that this year. I think we have the team to do that. And obviously win the state title. Uh, we've, we've gotten close a few times. We went to the state final, uh, lost 1-0 to uh, uh, Santiago Canyon from down south. Uh, and I believe this group has a chance to, to do that, assuming we can stay healthy and, and continue to improve. After CRC, I think I'm going to go to UC Santa Cruz. Oh, I'm not sure where I'm going after this season yet, but we'll see. I plan to hopefully keep playing soccer. Right now I'm just doing general ed, so I'm not really sure what career I want. Well, I want to play at a four-year university, so go, um, just depending on like who offers scholarships or who looks at me or what schools I go to, like, go, go to apply is where I will probably go. After soccer at CRC, I plan to quit soccer and go to Harvard and study law and become a lawyer. After CRC, my plan is to transfer to Sac State. I'll most likely be going to Yale and getting my biochemistry major and becoming a doctor.